Okay, so for this video, we're going to look at one of the most important parts of Apollo, which is peer assessment. So to start this, I'm going to go into my units. And down the right hand side, you'll see that in my units, I've actually had lots of students uh, make comments on some of the things that I've written. And you can see some of the feedback that I've given, um, ridiculous feedback, just in this different color here. So feedback is going to be an important part of what you're expected to do. And to demo this, we're going to go into forces. And we're going to go into mass and weight. This is a unit we'll look at um, later on in the semester. And I'm going to go to this YouTube video. Now I'm just going to make sure this stays paused. Good. And down here, you'll see there are peer assessment requests. I'm going to click that. And you'll see it comes up with this little window with um, six different people in here. Now, these three students they've left the school, which is why their pictures don't exist anymore. But we've still got three students and their work. So I'm going to click on um, ESA's. And what that's going to do is it's going to open the work that ESA did on this video. So these are notes that were made by this student. And what I can do here is I can click on this. It'll make the video go to that location and start playing. And I can give feedback to the student on that particular note. So ESA is wrote at this point, since it weighs more, more force is needed to resist the object's motion. And um, that's great. That's a really nice thing to say. So I'm going to say, great work, ESA. And I'm going to maybe try and ask him a question. So um, what would happen if this were on another planet? Question mark. I hit enter, and that will submit that feedback. Notice how I got a few points for doing that as well. And now when I click on this, you'll notice that my feedback has been added to this note. And the student will be able to see this both here and on this page here. So the student will know that feedback's been given. And hopefully, they'll come and find this feedback, and they'll respond to that as well. So you can do this for one another, and you are expected to by clicking this button here. So I'm going to click to request that my work be peer assessed. That will turn red once it's done so. Now, if I reload this, you'll notice now in peer assessment requests, my picture's there as well, because I've asked for other people to assess my work. Now, if I click on this, I have no notes, because I haven't done anything on this yet. So let's just add in a few notes to this. Let's go to a random point. Let's write a random note, click Submit, and that's down here. And now when we click on myself, you'll notice that my random note exists down here. I can even use this functionality to write feedback to myself. So this was not very useful feedback for myself. I can write, hit Enter, get some points, because you get points for giving feedback. And I'll note that that is now on my note. And so this is how we can give feedback to other students on their work. And this is something that is critical to learning with Apollo.